Welcome back everybody, DB55 back in this beast, and in light of the recent updates to the hardened steel recipe, I figured I'd go ahead and make a guide on the best spot to farm for black ice. As always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Without further ado, let's get into it. Alright, so we'll be heading to, we're going to head way up north, obviously, to get the ice, uh, black ice. We'll be heading to the Temple of Frost, which is all the way up here at you can see right next to the volcano, this is by far the best spot to farm for black ice, so... Alright, um, just to show that, that uh, this, is, this can be done pretty easily and even at a low level, I'm gonna go ahead and show you that everything I have is a level 40, uh, that you can get at level 40. Uh, we're gonna load him up with some food, as you can see all all basic items on him. Same thing with me. All my stats are just level 40, nothing special, no cheating. And we're just going to load him up with a little bit of food. And um, I'm going to show you how much black ice you can get in here. I'm going to run through it so you can see how easy it is. And we're back. All right. Um, yeah, so let's throw some food in there. Um, I have a little base set up outside, you know, right where the ob obelisk is, to get him to follow us. Um, there is some black ice scattered around here, um, in a couple spots, as you can see when we're approaching. Um, you could get a little bit out of there if you're just looking for just, just enough to build one preservation box or something like that. You could you could just go and grab this real quick and, and leave, but... If you're looking for a lot of black ice for your hardened steel, then you're going to want to head inside. Um, so I'm going to show you. It's pretty easy. You can The, the way you take on about 99% of the enemies in this game, uh, you can do without ever actually engaging them yourself in combat. So I'm going to show you a little bit of how I do it. You can see over here, if you come here, you can get the totems. More black ice to get. And you just use a basic bow and arrow just to get their attention. And we'll just run away until they start fighting each other. Alright, so he's already so he's fighting one already. Now, I could fight this guy directly, but I didn't really feel like it because I'm, I'm lazy. But, um, I wanted him to do all the work. Alright, now he's fighting both. You can see with the roasted haunch, uh, he, he does get a, a bit of a boost, so he's not really taking too much damage. It's, you can see he's doing pretty good damage to them. But... Um, part of this little farming method, you're, you're, you're not even gonna... Technically, you could run past these guys, I think, but just to be on the safe side, we're gonna kill the, the entrance guys. Oh, he's got him basically dead. So you got them both. You can see they have pretty basic loot on them, nothing too special. But now since you have those two guys dead, now you can easily come back in here. Now you could travel further out into this cave to get more black ice, but you really don't need to. Unless, you, unless if your server is well populated or something, but... So you just jump down here, slide down the wall, and there is a gold mine of black ice. Um, there's two chests here. You can see the guys haven't... There's two guards in this room. They haven't even bothered to come over here yet. I haven't aggroed them yet. Uh, there's pretty good loot in here. What I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and uh, uh, start mining some of this. And once we get to the end of it, I'll show you how uh, I'll show you how we escaped, and then I'll show you how much we got. Yeah. 
And we're back. All right. Um, I'm gonna wrap it up right here. You can see I'm getting five and six per swing. If you're if you're using you know a better pick, you're obviously gonna get more uh, when you come down here. But just for showing that it's easy and very obtainable, I'm gonna use just everything at level 40. All right. So you can see the guards. We're just gonna run right past them. They're they're dumb. Don't worry about them. As you can see, what a cunning escape I just had. Alright, next we'll go over how much we got from them. Alright, as you can see, we got about 1700 or so from that one little run just using a normal steel pick. Um, you can obviously expect to get more if you have a better pick, but that's not too bad for, for just a few minutes of doing it. Easily farmable. Alright everybody, that'll wrap up my Black Ice Farming Guide. If you found this guide helpful, like and share this video, and subscribe to my channel. Have any thoughts? Let me know down below in the comments section. And as always, thank you for watching.